Hi Pisces, this is Kelly <clears throat> from Moon Pie Tarot. This is your general love reading for February 2018. This is for Pisces Sun, Moon Rising, or Venus. If you would like to get a personal reading from me, download the Instant Go app and you can connect with me on there under Moon Pie Tarot. Or go to moonpietarot.com and all the information will also be there. You can follow me on Instagram and Facebook. As on Instagram, I put up weekly and lots of other goodies and tidbits. Also, Moon Pie Tarot. Okay, so this is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for February 2018. What are the energies for Pisces? Sun, Moon, Rising for 2018. Okay, so you're starting with the Six of Wands, so I'm seeing a lot of victory coming February, and I know you guys need it. Some of you could have a situation that you're dealing with a fire sign, male or female. This is general reading, so it could go either way. This fire sign would be Aries, Sagittarius, or Leo. Uh, she's a benefit, she or he, is a benefit to you in your life someone new or someone that you're currently dealing with this person is very warm confident loving full of strength has a very fiery passionate energy about them um, could be a mother or a parent outgoing type of energy could be a bit popular but I feel like with the six of wands here if this is someone that you uh, are currently dealing with and it doesn't have to be fire sign it could just be you know someone who picks up that energy this is someone that you're currently dealing with I'm seeing a, a victory with this person in February there's going to be a sudden change happening in your life Pisces with the tower card here there could be um, well let me clarify and see if I can find out what that might be okay temperance you're gonna be a peace I feel like things are gonna start making sense in love this month there's harmony <clears throat> and that's something that you may have not been feeling for quite some time in the past and I know your last few readings it was always that energy of having to wait 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 so I feel you're getting this balance coming to you finally feeling a peace and it could have something to do with the fire sign or just this other person it could also too be for some of you where you're sensing a victory within yourself now you finally have come to this place where you just feel like oh finally I'm okay everything's okay everything will be okay no worries or fears anymore yeah, your past position, as I was saying, was just this waiting energy <coughs> with the Nine of Wands. Uh, you know, kind of like uh, taking a step back, you're tired of battling, needing a break. You know, the Nine of Wands, she's always, <laughs> in my last reading, someone uh, fixed my inability to articulate what I was trying to say. But as I was saying in a boxing ring, um, between rounds, you know, taking that, that break, you know, figuring out your next, you know, movement forward. And I see you here coming out of that now and being, coming from that boxing match, that ring, being in the ring and now being victorious, finally feeling this place of peace in February. Either that you're going to meet someone new or finding that peace with this person. 
and whatever whatever may have happened that caused this shakeup actually was necessary in order to induce temperance so I don't know if it was uh, some of you could be you know moving needing to move or leave a relationship and and physically move house or um, are you know you and, a, and the other person working on building a home or building a business together you know uh, f just a feeling of satisfaction I feel is coming for you what's crowning you is the five of pentacles there's a lot of supportive energy around you you may feel still like or, or think in your mind that you know oh uh, I'm still out in the cold, you know, even though things are changing and I'm feeling better. You know, you're not out there alone, though. I feel like you and your, uh, you and your, uh, the other person are kind of like in this, you're in this place where it's just the two of you now. And you're supporting each other and you're giving to each other through hardship, through trial. And even if this is someone new coming in for you, this is the energy that's going to play out with this person. That you and this person have this, you know, it's like you're, you're in this hardship or you're going through something very similar and you come together to support each other through this. Either financially or just bring stability to one another. It's, it's the feeling of... of even when you feel left out in the cold, there is someone by your side. There will be someone by your side. And so now you have the King of Wands coming in the near future as well. So, and the King of Pentacles. What's going on, Pisces? You have probably... So for those of you, if this is not this queen, for, so you're female. If you're female, okay, I'm going to tell you, this queen of wands is your energy, okay? You're taking on the energy of a fire sign. You may have fire in your chart somewhere, but you are, you, you're coming from January of tired of waiting, taking on this empowerment role where now you're going to decide you're going to choose, you know, um, and you want people to be behind you and support you. And you've got, if you're female, you've got two males coming in. King of Wands and the King of Pentacles. Okay? So again, a fire sign and an earth sign. Now, if you're a male, these are just perhaps two people who are trying to, um, are supporting you in some way. Okay? With a fire female okay um, not many of my subscribers are men mostly women so um, but I have to say for either side these two males older gentlemen king of wands and it could be two females just saying because the gender can switch but fire sign and an earth sign and this earth sign very grounded practical business oriented makes money not overly emotional uh, but definitely sensual and the king of wands is also older with the fiery energy of the queen of wands but a bit more reserved both popular I feel like could be in an in entertainment or uh, you know a situation where uh, these two people probably work together or they are they could be brothers or they could be related um, they're going to be significant or these are just two men if you're a female who are coming after you <laughs> you know uh, not in a negative way because they're not in the reverse uh, they could have just wanted to clarify the five of swords they're f these both okay ladies <laughs> both of these men are going to be fighting for your attention February so keep your eye out for them 
You're not going to be alone in February, I'll tell you that. And you've got the Two of Cups here in position of you. So you're going to be meeting someone in February, definitely for the singles, that you make a connection with. Okay. Um... <coughs> Or this is you making connection with your partner. And and it's also the advice for you to focus on that energy to do that. How the other people are viewing you or the other person they're viewing you is you're you know, you're you're done fighting. You have decided that you are just going to be a winner. You're not going to fight to be a winner. You are being the winner. You are drawn to the light. This is what they see. They see, I feel like you, Pisces, have been like this warrior. Like you've been uh, struggling. You take on so much. So many people's emotions, you know. And, and it's really just you getting your confidence up and out there. Um to start believing in yourself, you know, and the six of swords, this talks about someone who's, you know, she's dropping her swords, the battle's over, she's moving on, and that's what people are seeing in you, and that's very attractive, because you're no longer uh, staying in a position of lack of victory, you're no longer setting yourself up to lose. Now, your hopes and fears, you have the Ace of Pentacles. So, you know, you want a new beginning. You you, you are hoping that <coughs> there will be solidarity, uh, new potential insecurity. This could be marriage or uh, relationships that bring you a foundation and the structure and this is what you're hoping for. And of course you fear that you will never find that. But I feel like you're going to have two options, maybe three. As far as love goes for February. Um, two people fighting on, over you because you've embodied this, this victory <laughs> state of mind. Where you, you have your confidence. And especially if you're single. And if you're, you are currently in a relationship with someone, uh, that you're still taking on this energy of, you know, not taking any more bull from anyone, um, these two people here are significant in some way. They're going to be fighting for your attention for something. Your outcome is the chariot. <coughs> so that's beautiful. That's a card about forward movement, travel, someone could be coming to see you, you could be going to see them, and strength, yeah, you're, you, you are all about this, I don't care who comes, I'm going to do me, I don't care what happens, I'm focusing on my abilities, my skills, I'm focusing on my confidence, I'm staying true to myself, I'm going to continue to support others because that's who I am. But you're telling yourself, my goal here, I'm shaking the shack up because I want peace of mind. I want harmony and happiness in my life. And you doing that, okay? You may This may have been your plan of attack since last month. You may have realized, you know, I'm tired of being in this situation. What's my, what's my next move here? What do I need to do for myself? And so you start doing this, and then, you know, here come these two, vying for your attention and your interest, fighting for it, right? And you're going to make a connection with one of them. And there's going to be a movement and love towards the end of the month. 
a very uh, strong bond. Look at you. You've got the star here. I kind of feel like you're going to be moving forward with this King of Wands. I feel like he's got more something that you blend better with. Okay, because I feel like this person, there's some popularity that e will equally match your own in February. For some reason, I feel like you're going to be very popular for something or with, with many people. I feel like mm, because of your confidence and your ability to, uh, you know, not be sad you're gonna get like start making plans to get out there i don't know maybe you're gonna start a fitness routine or you're gonna you know try to make yourself fix your hair or do something different or change your clothing or you know move move into a different home or you know get a new job everything's positive it's like moving positively for you and and there's a lot of support around you and i feel like that's what's helping you because you've been picking up on that you've been utilizing it you're you're ending the month here like a superstar full of faith and 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 hope you know and major change happening with the chariot so i mean you're not really ending i mean you're going to make a connection and i feel like it could be with the fire sign you will make a connection with this person uh, will you be into a relationship or anything? I'm not quite seeing that yet for February, but there will be a beautiful connection with, with one of them. It could also be with the, the King of Pentacles. You'll have to see because they're, got, they're both going to be fighting and you're going to have to make a decision. You actually <coughs> probably brought on more than you wanted <laughs> in February. But it feels very positive for you that these, these, uh, you know, whoever these men are, or, you know, if they're females, if you're a male, are very attracted to your energy in February. So keep doing what you're doing, you know, stick with your game plan, you know, keep building your confidence and moving forward. Okay, Pisces. So that was your reading for February. I hope that you enjoyed that. Thank you so much. And I'll see you in March. All right. Take care. Bye.